What's up guys, how you doing? So this is the last day um, that we're here today at this beautiful location. Uh, you can see the rain has been coming down uh, quite hard here. In fact, it's been raining for literally 24 hours non-stop. Uh, it's just starting to slow down now, a little bit of drizzle, but so many of you have said you want a tour of my bivvy. So um, yeah, I thought I'd give you one. So here we go. The actual bivvy itself um, is called a Tempest V2. It's made by Tracker. Um, and almost every bit of my uh, sort of luggage and tackle and whatnot is made by Tracker, uh, who are an absolutely fantastic company. Um, this one in particular has got like a unique system to put it up. Now at the moment you've got a tent, a, a bivvy in there and then you've got a wrap over the top of it, which creates like an air layer, which means you get no condensation. Um, but if you Google te Tracker Tempest V2, um, you'll see exactly how it goes up and it's incredible. It literally goes up in a couple of seconds it's an incredible system it's a shame you can't see it actually but it's underneath that wrap um i haven't opened the door all the way because uh, obviously it's raining out here uh, but on the front there you can see here we've got a vent so if you open that up it's like a mesh same on the other side and you can see the mesh there that you have uh, behind the front door and that means that when it's like warm uh, you can open it up and uh, still be protected from uh, all the mosquitoes. Round on the back, you've got the same thing. So uh, a vent each side if you want to open them up, and that lets the air go all the way through the bivvy. Um, so in those like summer warmer months, you don't get too hot, um, and you just let a little bit of air through. So yeah, let's um, open this up a bit more. Everything's gonna get soaking wet now. Uh, and take a look inside. So you can see, first of all, I've got a tracker doormat there. Um, when you tread on that, it basically kind of takes all the liquid and mud off your feet and then when you go into the bivvy you're not sort of dragging it all in there. A uh, heavy duty ground sheet there on the floor, just a bait bucket there uh, to the side with lots of bait in, got some boilies on the top there. Most of the bait I use is either made by myself or by a uh, main line. Uh, then you've got my bed. The uh, bed is a uh, tracker, what is it called? I forget the name of it. Oh, a tracker level light. Um, and it's completely flat. There's no bumps or lumps or anything like that. It's completely flat. Uh, and this is the wide version. It is really, really wide. Um, down there on the floor, as we go in, not on the floor, but attached to the bed, uh, is what we call um, a, be a bed buddy. And that just means that you've got a place to store like your important stuff, like your glasses, your wallet, uh, your passport and all that. And you know where you're going to put it every day. Now, the actual sleeping bag that I'm using here, this particular one, uh, it's made by a company called Fox. It's 100% waterproof. Um, they actually use the same material they use to make their bivvies out of. And this one's got four layers. So it's got this layer, this layer, and then the same in reverse on the bottom. And you can choose which layer you sleep in. So you can open this up and have a fleece layer, really, really soft fleece layer. I prefer the shiny stuff. Um, and you can do the same on the bottom as well. So you can sleep in any one of three layers uh, between three different sheets. And this thing, you could literally sleep on ice uh, in this. And in fact, if I pull it back, you can see how big it is. Uh, it's absolutely huge. Look at that. Looks like a fucking film star's bed. Um, and I've got two tracker pillows, a big one uh, and a little one. Like they're reversible, either cotton or fleece. And then over the top of my bed, um, I've got this. And this is just a, a fleece waterproof cover. Now, there's no need to have it waterproof while I'm indoors, obviously. But if sometimes you decide to sleep outside, uh, you want to be able to protect yourself. And this just adds an extra layer of warmth, really. Uh, or if it's really warm, you can just sleep underneath this. Uh, and this sort of clips onto the bed uh, as well. So, yeah, there's no chance chance whatsoever that you're going to get cold uh, or wet or anything like that in this particular setup. Down here, this is the car battery that I made ages ago. Um, I've got some waterproof red LED lights there on the top. And the reason I use uh, red is because it doesn't fuck up your night vision. So you can sort of have it quite bright in here with those red lights, um, just giving off like a dull light. But when you go outside in the pitch black, it means that you don't have to adapt to pitch blackness because it doesn't mess up your night vision. Uh, also, I've got um, a three port uh, USB cigarette lighter thing there so I've, I can charge up all of my devices and whatnot. Um, and then I've got this arm here, which attaches to anywhere really, um, with the iPad on so I can just kind of lay in bed and you don't have to hold it um, and you can just leave it like that. iPad Air 2, that one. Uh, over here, that's the receiver for my bite alarm. It's got a tracker towel. Uh, a tracker um, tackle bag and then this is a tracker gadget bag 
and in here I've got all my gadgets. I've got um, the Galaxy Edge. I've got another iPhone in there, I think, somewhere. Um, I've got a few different bits and pieces in there. Loads and loads of battery packs uh, in there as well. Um, I've got my, my earpiece, and there's my watch there. Better take that out, actually. Um, yeah, all kinds of different uh, bits and pieces in there. There's another iPhone 6 there. Um, and then we've got the uh, tracker camera bag and in here the one that i decided to bring with me was um the gh4 does 4k video great little camera and i've also got my uh, gopro in there as well uh, and a few other bits and pieces to go with it so yeah also down the back there is a bed is a chair and that you can pull out and put it on top of your bed and you can sit back on it and then in the roof i've got an led remote control light so yeah that right there is a tour of my bivvy now just to finish it off to show you my rods and reels in case anyone gives a shit here we go this is what i've got set up at the moment um these are the century c2 uh rods they're absolutely beautiful beautiful rods uh, if you're not doing long distance and then on there um i've got the uh, shimano uh, magnesium uh reels as well they're ridiculously light uh, phenomenal casting distance amazing line lay um, and then I've got my Delkin bite alarms and they're all covered in uh, carbon fiber uh, stickers just to make them match the uh, buzz bars uh, and the rods that you can see there focus somehow oh, it's not gonna focus but yeah so that's my rods as well this is a view of the swim that I'm in absolutely beautiful and that is it from me, guys. Um, I'll be back with you soon. Hope you're having a great week. Peace.